everybody. The, the time has come. This is the, my first day of Rad Tech school. I cannot believe it. I am running a tad bit behind. Not late, but behind. I wanted to get up a little bit earlier, but um, I slept in a little bit longer. So I've got like maybe 15 minutes or so, so I'm gonna kinda hurry up. I was gonna do some makeup. I think I'll do like a little bit and then um, head out. shirt and then hopefully this is the right color I have another pair that's a slightly different color and let's hope for it being the right one so if not thankfully it's the first day of school <laughs> For lunch, I'm having leftover hot roast that I made. Rice, green beans, and then some watermelon. Get a fork. Finally, benefit of stealing forks from restaurants. Well, not stealing, but taking more than I should. Nature Valley bar, and then let me get some ice water, and we are out the door. And hopefully, I didn't forget anything. Y'all, it's so weird. It's so weird vlogging. I'm like not used to this at all. I think I need to get another car thingy because this is not working. I don't think I'm gonna have time to put makeup on today. That's okay though. I never thought there would be a day where I was like, dang, I'm not gonna have time to put makeup on today. I Me, mean, who am I? I got two hours to get to school. I gave myself enough time so that I can like make sure I know where everything is, which I'm pretty sure I do, but I don't know what the traffic situation obviously is gonna be looking like in the mornings getting there. Um, so I give myself time, ample amount of time. Let my car warm up and let's go. Okay, so made it with like 40-ish minutes to spare. Yeah. 40 minutes to spare, so it didn't take long at all. I think, I mean, it's definitely a little drive, like it's an hour drive from where I, from our house, but I'm from Atlanta and like traffic here is just not the same. Like driving an hour somewhere is nothing to us that live in Atlanta, that's just kind of standard, honestly. And when I went to Kennesaw, I used to drive two hours to and from school because of traffic. Oh my God, that was a beast. I freaking hated it my last couple semesters. I, I commuted from home like I lived with my mom and and it was literal literal torture. Thankfully, I didn't have to go every single day, but that freaking sucked. Um, let me go in my emails real quick to see. Clearly not gonna be putting on makeup this morning, but it's fine. What is, oh, and I need to stop by the campus bookstore actually have not come in and I ordered it like weeks ago all right so we're gonna be in this building okay upstairs let me screenshot that and then let me see what time does this bookstore open because they are tripping over there for real 
other hours. I got one of them, but that was an ebook, and I I don't know. I paid for everything. Everything's paid for. Bookstore. Hi, Courtney. Thank you. Thanks. Lazy Sunday mornings, hiding under right. cover. So, we roll us back from class. Our first day of Rad Tech School, and it went very well. Today, I just had uh, procedures and procedures lab today. I think it's like intro to procedures, something like that. Um, I did end up finding or getting my book. I just think the, the ah, I just think the bookstore at the location that I'm at is just not the best that they suck. Uh, I mean, I understand that they have a lot going on, but you gotta let students know if their book's here. It's literally been there for a while. Never got a notification. I do need to get my handbook, like the pocketbook, um, for when clinical start, but that'll be a whole nother thing. But everything went well. Um, it's a very small group of students, which I really like. I kind of like the smaller setting anyway. Um, I knew it was gonna be small because they don't let a lot of students in um, per year. Um, and thankfully the campus that I'm on, I never ate this, so I'll eat this later. Um, the campus that I am on is small, so it's very easy and simple to find everything. I came from a pretty big university, so when I went in, uh, to college, so that was cool. Um, what else? What else is going on? But yeah, today was just kind of, we went over the syllabus and then we got straight into coursework, which coming from a science background, that's kind of how it works anyways. Um, we always start with, you know, the lesson. I got Chick-fil-A, I have a pounding headache. Actually, I don't have a BC. I thought we had BC powders. Yeah, my husband has ate all of them or taken all of them. Um, so I do feel like I'm having like a little cold come on so I'm gonna take this I don't know if it's my allergies or if I'm getting sick like I cannot tell the difference which one is cold I'm gonna take two or one mm. you will have two and it's probably hard to open so I'm going to actually start studying because um it's a lot of information I'm not gonna lie it's definitely a lot Thankfully, I like I said, I do have a science background and I'm used to it. So it's not anything that I'm not accustomed to. Um, but it's definitely like, girl, you cannot be procrastinating with this. I also learned that we can't. Oh, hi. Okay. Well, that's great. Um, we cannot get below a 78 on grades. So um, yeah, that's that's definitely scary. Um, I, I know overall we can't get 78s, but I'm pretty sure on like any exams and stuff, like we cannot get below. And she said, even if you get a 77.99999, you fail. My best friend went to nursing school and hers was like a 75 and I thought it was crazy when, she, when we were in college. A 78 is wild. Oh, hi. 